The word was out. A special visitor was returning home. And all eyes were focused on native son Michael Jordan. For 23, Michael Jordan. And Jordan gave them more than their money's worth. As he and teammate Scottie Pippen slam dunk Chicago to an early advantage. Led by Michael Holden, Charlotte made a third quarter run. But Chicago's Michael was still the main attraction. And the Bulls maintained the lead. In the fourth, the Hornets looked down low to Tim Kempton. Jordan had the answer. But as Rambis got free on the pick and roll, and Trapuca buried a three-pointer, Charlotte took a two-point lead. Though Jordan managed to tie the score with 26 seconds remaining, Charlotte countered Chicago Superman with their own version of Clark Kent. Holton guiding the club at the point. 13 on the shot clock. 14 on the game clock. Kempton comes out to get the ball. Kempton dribbles down the left side. Takes it baseline. Almost loses it. Five on the shot clock. Reed, head fake. Turn, fire, shot. Block. Rambis with a shot. No good. Rebound. Rambis up and in with a tap. It's good. Hornets win. Hornets win it. 103-101 on Kurt Rambis' tip in at the buzzer. The fans went crazy, the players went crazy, I went crazy. I'd never done that before. It was like we'd won the championship at that point in time. Listen to this crowd! Meanwhile, at the scorer's table, Wally Rooney, Doug Collins, all the officials are still on the floor. So let's wait just a second. The Hornets are long gone, but the Bulls and the referees are still out there. Well, Collins is going now. He's uh, now it's over. satisfied, and uh, this game is in the bag.